who is in love with the hit show Empire. <laughs> Such a good show. So good. So today we decided we are going to take a little bit of inspiration, if you will. Shai DeLuca Tomasi in our Empire inspired <laughs> set. Good morning, good morning. I love it. You love it. Okay. The fashion, the decor, mm -hmm. everything is over the top. Right? Everything is over the top fabulous. And yeah. you know what? For a gay man, over the top design, yay! Yay! I'll <laughs> so, take yeah, it! Right? Exactly. So, you know, the one thing that I like to tell people is, especially when you're pulling from a TV show set, a movie set, don't be so literal. Right. So let's look at the two shots that we brought in of the actual set, and they're beautiful. They're really over the top, but is it really something that we could live in on a daily basis? Probably right, you not. want to look at it and you want to say, oh my gosh, we got like a patterned rug, we got yes. patterned wall tape paper, we got a lot of color going on. Everything's going on, yes. which is amazing, and it looks great on camera, but like I say, so when we go home at the end of the day, are we going to actually live in that space? It might be a little bit difficult. It might be a little bit loud. A little bit loud. <laughs> which Empire is, which is why I love it. But yeah, it down a little, <laughs> a little bit. bit loud. So instead, let's pull inspiration from the show and from things that we know about the show. Right. All right? So for those of you who watch, and I know we all do, my favorite character is Cookie. She oh, my gosh. love her, right? All about Cookie, usually in the head-to-toe animal print. Yes. Although she is calming it down for this season because Shh. she's got some competition. She's trying to class it up a little bit. <laughs> right? Got, you know what? It's okay, but Cookie, I love you. Wear the animal print. You're good. You're, good. You're fine. It's fine. So we really want to pull inspiration, and we want to pull that kind of opulence that has the, that the set has, but like I say, don't go over the top. Yeah. Let's start off with the wall color. So this is Benjamin Moore Kalamata, and what I like about this is it's a jewel tone. Yeah. And jewel tones are really popular in kind of the hip hop culture, which Empire is inspired by. Yeah. And so this was kind of our jumping off point for, for the room. What's really nice about this is that this wall color works really well with the rest of the furniture that we've chosen for the set. And all of this is from South Hill Home. It's gorgeous. It is fabulous, fabulous stuff. Let's start with the sofa. Mm -hmm. So the sofa is actually wool. And what you'll notice about Empire is that there's a lot of deco inspired pieces. Yeah. Deco is hot. It's always been hot, never going out of style. It's a classic. But sometimes deco can be really, uh, it's really compartmentalized and it's hard to do everything deco. So I like to choose one larger piece like we did yeah. here with the sofa and then jump off from that. Okay. A beautiful blue color works really nice uh, against the, uh, the almost like an aubergine wall. And um, let's let's then look at the side table. So these are a personal favorite of mine. They're opulence done very tastefully, I would say. Exactly. So they have like the black in it, which is a nice grounding, but they are mother of pearl. Yeah. Like yummy, 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 yeah, yummy. gorgeous. Absolutely love that. And if you notice also, Tracy, the mother of pearl inlay also have different tones in it. So it almost pulls everything that we see in the space together. Yes, it does. Right? Are we going to talk about that artwork? Let's talk about that artwork. Because that is gorgeous. It looks like <laughs> one of those gorgeous stones you get. They make jewelry out yes, of. It the is petrified, beautiful. The petrified yes. stone. Absolutely. So, so this is, again, uh, by South, uh, from South Hill Home. And these are fantastic. And what I like about them is that they're framed in like a plexi box. Right. So they almost float away. We're really concentrating on the artwork yeah. rather than on the frames themselves. And what's nice about it is that the beautiful gold leafing in it, I mean, that was really our jumping off points then for the rest of the gold details that we see in the space. Absolutely. So gold is a big... Uh, metal in Empire, I would say. It is a big metal Empire, and luckily, it's a big metal in interior design right now. Absolutely. I mean, it's hot, hot, hot. And the nice thing about gold tones and metallics in general in, in interior design now is that we can really mix them. Yeah. Before it was all about, no, I'm doing stainless steel, no, I'm doing gold, no, I'm doing copper. Yeah. It's all about mixing. It's all about mixing now. Yeah. Are those goblets over there? These are not goblets, although, I mean, I guess you could put a little... That, however, let's talk about that for a second. You want to talk about, this, let's talk about this guy. Is so, this for your drink? Yes. I love I it. know. Everyone You're, in the audience should have one of these beside sure. their chair. I agree. And a small cocktail. A personal drink table. And what I really like about the bottom is that it has that, um, it has the, almost like a pineapple, pineapple. I guess it would be. Yeah. So uh, really beautiful inspiration from the set. Uh, let's for a second look at the coffee table. So if you look at the top of the coffee table, the inlay in it is almost like a starburst. Yeah. It's starburst great. was a really popular, popular motif in, in uh, Art Deco and interior design. Uh -huh. So we've done this in a way that's it's subtle. It's not over the top, not crazy. Now, you talked about animal print being really everywhere in Cookie's Big. home, all over what she was wearing. Yes. Animal print can get a little tiresome after a while if yeah. everything is done in it. It can get kitschy. It can get kitschy. So look at the beautiful stool that we brought in, the beautiful stool for, uh, for the chair. Look at the lines on it. The, the zebra print, it's subtle, it's classy, yes. and the lines on it are beautiful. And then we paired it with that beautiful chair. It's an Art Deco feel, but then we've also um, added that beautiful throw. Now, will you look at that throw? I was wearing oh, that before as a scarf when we were setting fur. up the set. It's so oh fabulous. My gosh. I was like, I love it. Love it, love it, love yeah, it. Yeah, no, this is definitely an outfit. Right? Right. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> 
<laughs> Love that. Love it. Oh, you're perfect. She is cook. You're anyway. Okay. <laughs> you are cooking. You are you're channeling her. <laughs> channeling my channeling. cookie. Uh, the rug, the hide. So this is from LT. Yes. Um, you know, hide is really easy to do. And what I like about hides are is that they are not perfectly square or perfectly rectangle. So mm -hmm. they work in spaces that have corners, that have odd angles. Yeah. They really fill up the space nicely. Uh, I, we chose these really inexpensive I palms. Love these. They're inexpensive. These are kind of, you see them everywhere. They're bamboo palms. They're inexpensive. They're from Sheridan Nurseries. Yeah. And this is the one thing that I like to tell people is, is when you're doing an opulent set over this or over the top, not set seat, I said set, over mm -hmm. the top room, is you want to choose your more expensive pieces, your more investment pieces, yep. but you can then absolutely add some inexpensive pieces and everything looks expensive all yeah. of a sudden, right? Mix it up. Mix it up. It's absolutely beautiful. These are gorgeous too, I might add. I love these. So, so again, for those of us who watch the show, there is that edginess in the yeah. show um, with one of the younger sons, one of the younger sons in the show. And I like this because it has, this is actually 24 karat gold. This is from my private home collection. So this I actually <laughs> brought in and I thought, you know what, I got to put a piece of myself in this set. Um, these are great, but they have that cage look to it. So yeah. it's a lot more industrial, a lot more edgy, yes. just like the show is. When you're done with it, you just melt it down to make a big medallion. Done. Yes. Or big done. earrings. Two of them. Like big one, earrings. One. <laughs> so good. If you want to catch Show Me, of course, you can catch all new episodes of Empire uh, on Show Me. Yes. So that's the place to get it. Wednesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern on City and on citytv.com.